Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I started to film, or excuse me, I started to play with my makeup and then I thought why don't I just film this and do a get ready with me. So anything that I'm listing will be in the description box down below. I usually have everything linked. Um, if I don't have it linked it's because it's already linked in another video and let's just do a chatty get ready with me because I haven't played with my makeup all week. Ugh. Okay, um, so I already put on my tinted moisturizer. That was step one. Um, but I am going to go in with a little bit of concealer over some spots. So I started my new job this week and it's been pretty interesting. Um, the reason why I haven't really been wearing makeup is we have to wear masks at my job. Um, even if you are vaccinated because I live in an area where people are dumb and are wearing masks or not wearing masks when they're not vaccinated. So now everybody's getting sick again. Um, and it's been interesting because even though they say to wear masks, there's definitely people in my office that like aren't wearing masks so I don't know we'll we'll see what happens if I leave my little office I always have it on and I don't know if I'm allowed to take my breaks and lunches in my office but I just started doing that too because I don't know like my office is also as big as the break room which is tiny like my office is an old utility closet and the break room is another old utility closet that they just put a table in there and call it a break room. Um, so I really don't want to be in a confined space with other people, really. Um, and from what I understand, people in my, in my school district had gotten COVID because they weren't wearing masks and practicing social distancing so I'm just I'm not gonna take my chances I'm just gonna keep to myself um but as far as like the job goes it's been pretty fun it's been pretty like I feel like Isabel from Animal Crossing because I just keep a record of all the kids in my school and then if you are applying for a job I will do like an education confirmation or if you're applying to colleges, I can print your transcript. So that's pretty cool. Um, everybody that I like have to email in the day, they all have little signatures on their emails. And then I don't, and someone asked me about it today. They're like, you can make one. Um, but I have to use like the school's logo and I would just rather use like our school mascot is like a snake of some kind. I don't know. I would just rather use Orochimaru, but I don't think they would let me. So I'm just not even going to bother. Um, I should do my eyebrows. Uh, but ever since I figured out that you can put water in your eyebrow gel, um, my whole eyebrow game has changed. Because I saw someone say you put add water to the Patrick Ta eyebrow gel and then I thought oh why don't I just do that to the ABH because I'm having the same problems as the people who didn't apply water to the Patrick Ta. And here we are. Big bold eyebrow gang. Wow. So like I might go to work like this and put on mascara like I try to at least to groom my eyebrows in a way um and I I didn't have to go to work wearing a mask because by the time COVID kind of took over I was already um excused and then furloughed from my previous job so it wasn't like that big of a deal but um now I have to wear the masks and like I said I I just I keep them on because I, I don't trust the people that I work with, really. There's all these signs everywhere about, like, 
wearing a mask and no one does it so anyway um but i wear it but i'm noticing like right here i'm getting like uh, if I put on like lotions and things, like it, it feels like it burns almost and like little red marks. Like my whole face like right here is red and I think that's just rubbing from the fabric. Um, I have one of those like Sanrio, like you can change the filter mask and I have um, like a mask, like a cotton mask. Like, I don't know. I'm not really using masks that are made out of like they're all made out of face material or made with like material to be used for masks um, So I don't know I don't know why it's getting so irritated, but now I kind of realize everyone's uh, Dilemma was wearing makeup and skincare and things like that. Like am I gonna buy Jaclyn Hill or Jaclyn Hill suggested like um, a Silk mask. It's like the same material as like a silk pillowcase but I live in the desert and I just, I don't want to sweat, you know, I don't know, but I also don't want to get sick. Do I, would I rather sweat and like not get sick with COVID? There are some teachers that are married to other teachers at my location, which is like whatever, you know, um, and some of them are like athletic, like the PE teachers. And I don't know why they're coming into that office. Like I don't. I don't understand, but they come in there and then they, they've they been making these jokes about like how young I look and they're like, oh, I thought you were a student. You know, I thought you were working here with like a worker's permit or something. And I just, why are they even coming to my little back corner office and talking to me? I don't get it. Because they're like not a part of like, I don't really talk to teachers because teachers don't really need access to records like that. All they do is submit, like if they give a kid a detention or whatever and it has to go on their disciplinary record, like they put it in themselves. They're like I don't even have to worry about that. Um, so I don't know. I just, I didn't understand the point of that, but it could have just been because a lady in, in my office, maybe she was really friendly and talked to everyone. I don't know. I just get random people who hop in there and they say, oh, hey, like, how's, how's it going? It's so busy in here, huh? There's so much paperwork. Like, I hear that 20 times a day. And I don't know. It just makes me really frustrated. Because if you don't have anything to say, why are you, why are you going back there? If there's no reason for you to talk to me, why are you going back there? Maybe I'm just not a friendly person. No, I think I am friendly. I just, why are you bugging other people at work? I don't know, I just don't like that. Why are you bugging someone who's, if you know that their job is busy, why are you bugging them? But I also just don't see the point in like wearing makeup to a job like that, especially if like I'm in my office and doing my whole thing. Like my job, like I, I leave for work really, really early in the morning, but I'm, back at home really early in the day so it's like not that big of a deal um so i don't know i i, I don't know we'll we'll see what happens as like the the school year goes on but like right now i'm just more focused on like learning the job and mastering the job than like what i look like i know that sounds crazy um so today let's play with some colors because i really want to do a colorful look I'm really excited that it's August. I'm starting to see uh, more postings for Halloween decor. Um, I don't know, do you already know what you wanna be for Halloween? Or is Halloween even a thing this year? Was Halloween even a thing last year? I don't really remember. I still bought candy, I think. Well, yeah, I always buy candy. Um, I don't know, I also don't really live in an area where there's like too many kids, I think, or like too many kids that are out trick-or-treating, so we'll see what happens. I don't know if I said this in a, in a previous video, but I wonder if they would let me come in costume to work. I don't know, This there seems to be... Uh, a lot of strict rules on dress code. I love the 
the shimmers in this palette. Like, I think Kleidos is really good at their shimmer shades, but when they have these like beautiful like duochrome shades in their collection, they're so easy to put on. Um, when I'm practicing a look, I'll usually practice with one of my Kleidos palettes because I know I can trust that the formula is really good. So to make my technique even better, um, or to, I guess to focus on my technique, I make sure that I'm using products that I know work well. I want to try that new uh, Sky High mascara that everyone's been loving. Um, not because it's a TikTok trend, but because I heard that it's like a dupe for this Bad Girl Bang uh, Benefit mascara. And I got a little sample of it from a girlfriend and I've really, really been liking it. And maybe I'm late to the game or maybe I just got better at applying mascara. I don't know because like when this came out, like I was still very much a part of like the makeup or I, I still pretty much was a beauty consumer. Um, and I had bought a full size before, but I really, really did not like it. Unless like they changed the formula. I don't, I don't know. I just, I'll say that like my skill just got better. Um, because it's definitely not as heavy on my lashes as I remember it being. And that makes me interested to try other things that make maybe didn't work out for me, but now that I know a little bit better, maybe they'll be like my favorite products. Who knows? But someone said that it was uh, the new Maybelline Sky High was like the more affordable version of this because I don't really like to buy, I don't like to buy full size mascaras. I usually buy like minis anyway um, because they do only last for three months and then you gotta toss them. So what's the point in buying a $25 mascara? You don't really go through it. But for like a seven, eight dollar price point, like I don't feel as bad, like that's not hurting my wallet as much, I guess. What do I want to do for a lip? <laughs> do I want to bring one of these plushy lips out? Sure, I'll go in with shade Butterscotch. I love these because I just like to pat them in. And I do like to use these with the lip liner. But for today, that's fine. I'm not really like the boldest thing is like my eye. And this is it for the look. Um, this is pretty fun for such a quick like get ready with me. But uh, I have other things that I need to film and get into and other chores that I need to do for the day. So I didn't really have the time to do like a whole, whole crazy look. Um, and I didn't, I did, I wanted to look cute. So what are some things that like maybe are keeping you from doing the things that you usually like to do? Uh, I know for me, I always like autumn more than I like the spring or summer time of the year because summer and spring are just always so hot and I'm just, I don't like it. And I like to wear jackets and I like the spooky season and I like when it's like more dark than it is light out for the day. Um, I don't know, some people complain when it's autumn and they're like, oh, it gets dark too fast, but I really, I really, really enjoy that time of the year. But I will see you guys in my next video. Thanks for letting me talk to you about work. And um, I will catch you in the next one.